All right, here's a very quick fix from LearnDigitalAdvertising.org to get rid of and really consolidate Facebook click ID traffic. So if you're watching this, chances are you went into Google Analytics and all of a sudden you noticed that a bunch of your landing pages or other pages are amended by a parameter FBCLID. This is Facebook's click tracking system. Uh, chances are this problem started the day you implemented Facebook's tracking pixel. So out of the gate, what's happening is Facebook is sending traffic with a click ID so that it can track what ha what's happened and pass information back to Facebook. Um, so what we're going to the issue with this obviously then is that your landing page reports aren't really correct. Like in this particular example, line item two, you can see this is really just my homepage, but Google Analytics right now thinks that my homepage is like seven or eight or 10 different pages, right? So what we wanna do is tell Google to ignore this parameter and just sort of roll all that up into the correct landing page or page report or you know that sort of thing. So super quick fix to this, you're gonna go into your Google Analytics account, admin at the view level, you're gonna to go to view settings. And we're just going to add the Facebook click ID to this exclude URL query parameters. And you can put many here. We're just going to fix Facebook today. But if we were to comma separate these, we could add five or six. And really what that's going to tell Google is ignore anything that has to do with this parameter. Um, and that's what we want to do here. So we're going to hit save. Now, unfortunately, this does not fix past data. This only fixed data going forward. So when we go back to our reports right now for this particular client, we'd still see it. Um, starting today, though, we should not see any information related to the Facebook Click ID. Hope this helps, and happy tracking.